This tutorial will explain how to grade a discussion forum using a rubric. You can access discussion forums either by clicking on the content link and finding the forum within the session folder, or you can view all discussion forums by clicking on the discussion link. To grade a discussion forum, first click on the name of the forum, then click on Grade Discussion Forum. Here are all the users in the forum. Click on the Grade button next to the user that you are about to grade. Here you can view all of the user's posts for that forum. To grade the forum, you can access the grading rubric two different ways. One way is to click this small gray box and the discussion rubric will pop into a new screen. Then you can click on the levels of achievement in this different criteria and within each level of achievement for each type of criteria you can enter additional feedback and you can do that for each box. You can enter additional feedback, general feedback, at the bottom of the rubric. And above that feedback box, you'll see a raw total that is automatically calculated as you click on the boxes above. If you want to override that raw total to a different total, enter it here. Then you'll click Save. Another way to access the rubric is to click on the title of the rubric. Then you'll see on a column on the right all of the criteria and the different levels of achievement. You can click on Show Descriptions to read the descriptions for each type of criteria, and you can click on Show Feedback for each type of criteria and level of achievement. As you grade, just click on the level of achievement for each type of criteria. Again, at the bottom, as with the other type of view for the rubric, the raw total is calculated for you. And if you want to override that total number, then you can enter it here. Then when you are through, you can click Save Rubric. The score, either the raw total, if you did not override it, or the, the total that you entered manually will be entered here. When you're ready to submit the grade and the feedback to the gradebook, click Submit. The grade is saved successfully in the gradebook. The grade is now viewable to students along with the rubric and feedback.